Hey, what's up everybody? I want to talk about something that was on my mind very much before I moved to Las Vegas. And that is how much exactly does it cost for electricity during the summertime? The last uh, month and a half, it's been really, really hot. Uh, we hit 100 degrees at least a couple times at the end of March. And we hit over 100, maybe five, six times in April and so far we're in May and we've hit 100 a few times too. So yeah, I mean I did some research on YouTube, Google, I found a few conversations. Uh, you know a lot of most of the the uh, information out there was talking about people in homes, you know, two-story homes and they were complaining that sometimes it cost two, three hundred dollars, sometimes more to uh, keep their homes cool in the summertime. And so I'm thinking, so you know, I'm reading this, I'm thinking, oh my God, am I gonna have to pay $300 for air condition? And when I first came here to Vegas in August of last year, I stayed in a small 500 square foot studio at the Holiday Royal. You may have seen one of my videos about it. And you know, that place was so small, a little studio, took no time at all to bring that thing from 85 to 75, maybe 20 minutes, maybe a little longer. Uh, here at uh, La Serena, I keep my thermostat at a steady 77. And I do that not because it's more comfortable at 77, but because that's the only setting that this thermostat will take without going absolutely bonkers. Because I put that thing at 76, 75, 74, anything less than 77, what it does, it tends to make this place really, really cold in a hurry. And that, you know, that kind of, you know, it kind of defeats the purpose because, you know, you're, if, you know, one thing you're too hot, another thing you're too cold. Next thing you know, I'm wearing sweaters, you know, and I'm paying a lot of money for electricity. So let's go and take a look at exactly how much I'm paying uh, for my electricity bills. Right now, I am in the bedroom, and it's a very comfortable 73 degrees in here. Sometimes I leave my window open, but it's just a very small window, and it, it doesn't get very hot around here. This is by far the most comfortable room in the in my entire place. Uh, I love sitting down here and you know I get my sunlight, I can read my book. It's very nice. Now as soon as I move this is the kitchen. As soon as I move to the living room, this is the living room. And I know you're not gonna be able to see that. Well maybe you can. 78 degrees in here, 77, 78, and that's about what my thermostat is set at right now. Now, if I were to say turn off my air condition and then go to work, come back eight hours later, it's 88 degrees in here, and I turn on my air conditioning to 77, it would probably take about an hour and a half to bring this place down to about 75, 76 which is not bad. My unit has an air conditioner. It's much better than the one that I had at the Holiday Royal. It's a real dedicated air conditioner. It's a heck of a lot better than the slide-in air conditioner that I was using at the Holiday Royal. This air conditioner is really powerful. This thing blows. Okay, folks, this is a snapshot of my Nevada Energy bill. And as you can see, I just paid $73.41 for last month's bill. Last month was pretty darn hot. And there are 21 days remaining in my billing cycle. My bill to date is $18. And at the current rate, my projected bill will be $61.
and my bill last month was $26.89. Now there's a pretty big jump there and the reason is for that is because this past month was really hot and my air condition was pretty much running every single day. And that's really the only thing that I did differently. Um, up to this point, I was just running the heat, in fact, uh, January, February, and uh, usually my bill was no more than $23, $24, but this at least gives you an idea of how much you could expect to pay. I live in North Las Vegas, and I'm here at La Serena. I have a one-bedroom apartment, and this place is about 720 square feet. So, to answer your question, how much does it cost to run the electricity for air conditioned during hot months in Las Vegas in a one bedroom apartment? And what I'm paying right there, $73. And my projected bill for next month, if I continue, will be 61. So, I expect it to be actually a little higher than 61. Uh, you know, this month is going to be hotter than last month. So I'll probably run the AC a little bit more. And part of the reason why this electricity bill was $73 last month was because we're in quarantine and I spent a lot more time in my uh, little apartment than I would have otherwise. Now, I'm going back, I've already started going back to work and I worked three days this past week. I'll be working three days next week and I'll probably turn off my air condition when I'm at work. So yeah, I mean, I probably, my bill will probably come down. Yeah, it might be around $60. It might even be a little less. So hopefully this gives you guys an idea of how much uh, at least one person pays for electricity in Las Vegas. Thanks so much for watching. See you in the next video.